Hello everyone. This is another episode of Kel's Tips. Today the project is to um, switch out the decks on these lawnmowers. The one we're looking at is the one that runs really good and is rusted out to the point where the right wheel falls off and the supports inside are all rusted out. And to solve the problem I am planning on moving that running motor onto this deck that I just picked up from salvage so stay tuned. Here's the problem with this lawnmower it runs great however the inside is damaged to the point where and rusted to the point where these wheels will basically just fall out and this interior guide for the grass catches on the on the blade causes damage so we have to switch out this rusty old deck for a better one. First step is to take the blade off so that uh, we can uh, remove the motor. Always remember to pull the spark plug wire off the spark plug when you're taking blades off because it could kick, could fire, could cut you. Be safe. Here's the setup to take up the uh, screw that holds the blade on just a support 2x4 braced on something and uh, I think it's a 9 16 nut uh, to unscrew the blade. Okay just a correction the center bolt is 14 millimeters that I'm using here for, for to take the blade off and we need 13 millimeters to take the three bolts out of the motor. So I'll proceed to do that. At this point you want to uh, disconnect any of the cabling or wires that are hooked between the motor and the handlebars. I've got the um, pull string disconnected so that when we take the motor off it isn't inhibited by a connection to the body of the lawnmower. Okay, so I've removed these two retaining bolts that hold the motor onto the deck. There's one more, it's loose. I'm going to turn this up on its wheels and roll it up on these car supports and take the final nut out so I can remove the motor safely without it falling off of the deck. Now I'm going to go underneath and take the final bolt out so I can remove the motor off the deck. Final bolt is out. Now I'm just going to rock this motor and lift it right off the old deck. Motor removed. Waiting to be mounted on the new deck. First things first we'll take a 19, 9 socket and we'll take this these wheels off. and a 13 millimeter socket to take the bracket nuts out. This plastic piece on the inside covers the, the nut on the 13 millimeter bolt. Therefore we have to take this support screw out on both sides in order to get the plastic to come come out. Okay so we take the support screw out of the, the other one and don't you know there's another one in here to take out before the whole unit comes off. Here's the plastic piece removed and now we have access to the bolts on the bottom and the top. There are another uh, two 10 millimeter bolts, one here, one at the top, that have to come out as well. Here it is, disassembled. Here is the, uh, the old connector plate on the new deck, transferred over perfectly. Here we go, we got the wheels on and all the good parts of a combination of handles and wires and we're ready to put on the motor. 
So here we are with the uh, motor on and tightened up, the blade back on, and the wheels put on from the from the old deck. We're just about ready to fire it up. Another project completed. This is Keld's tip saying, save the landfill, keep fixing.